What's up people, welcome back to another Lost Recollection guide. This time I'm gonna go over a quick video for how to speed buff in this game. So it's really useful if you're fighting the arena or fighting this guy here, especially the trial for all the weapons. And you want to get your buff faster because sometimes if you get hit in the middle of the buffs, you're gonna lose that buff. So to get that faster, um, it's pretty much similar to AL, another, another cool returning feature, it works. You just have to, you just have to, in, in AL when you speed buff, you, you used to have to like buff and then block, buff and block, buff and block like that. But in this game, you just have to hold it. It's really, really fast, but that's how you do it. So I'm going to demonstrate just by pressing R code um, and then holding the block button. It's so much faster. You don't have to worry about, you don't have to worry about the normal speed buff like this. Because you your character have to, you know, have to set feet and stuff. It's kind of annoying. But with that, you can just buff so much faster. Like you, you actually save you a tiny bit of time. But that's all you really need. And sometimes it really helps, especially the speed buff. It's really, really good, especially. Like I said, you want to do those one v one situations, and your character wants to buff faster. Yeah, just hold, just hold down the, just hold down the block button like this, the guard one. Um, if you're playing on, if you're playing on you now, Xbox is the uh, the right trigger. If you're playing on PlayStation is the, uh, it's R2. So yeah, that's pretty much it for this quick guy. And it's really, really, it's really, really, you know, fast. I mean, it's, it's a little bit faster, but overall when you do all five buffs, it saves you quite a bit of time. So anyway, hope you guys enjoy it. Until next time.